Hello everyone, I'm Maria Downey with this fast cast on this January 3rd, 2024. Here's a look at just some of your day's top stories. Several guns, generators, a Toyo stove and mammoth tusks were stolen from the Fairbanks area. According to Alaska State Troopers, the Fairbanks business is offering rewards for the return of several of the items. Troopers say you can call them or submit an anonymous tip through the AK Tip smartphone app if you have any information about the thefts. A Koyuk man accused of killing his father told troopers his marijuana must have been laced with something else. Franklin Adams said he remembers blacking out before attacking his father with a shotgun. He shot Dennis Adams once before having issues with the gun. So he grabbed a different one and fired that one as well. Franklin is being held in Nome and is charged with murder. A cargo ship carrying lithium ion batteries outside of Dutch Harbor is stable and reports no indication of heat in the cargo hold now after a fire broke out last week. The MV Genius Star 11 is keeping its pilot house manned and is ready to move if need be. Weather has caused flight delays in Dutch Harbor, so technical expert crews aren't able to reach the ship. A one-mile safety zone is in place around the vessel, according to the U.S. Coast Guard, and air quality on this ship and in the nearby community is being monitored. A qualifying race for the Iditarod has been canceled in Minnesota. The John Beargree Sled Dog Marathon was called due to a lack of snow in the area. This was to be the 40th running of the race, but officials say they made the decision in the best interest of the dogs, mushers, and volunteers, and a rescheduling would interfere with other established races. The race instead has been postponed until next January. Well, you can find these stories and much more on alaskasnewsource.com and on these streaming platforms throughout the day. From all of us, have a great day.